right up towards where the saddle horn will be. Then my ears towards the spot. Say move away. Those hind feet cross over. A nice fluid motion. So and you're safe where you are right now. What's that? You're safe where you are right now. Yeah. Basically. I mean, that, you know, you're always. D. Uh, what? Anytime can be in danger. But as a general rule, my safe spot is right here at the shoulder. Kind of at a 45 degree angle. I can't get struck. I can't get kicked. So as a general rule, that's the safe spot. So right here. And I'll work on that. Pin my ears. Say move your hindquarters. Move your hindquarters. Move your hind. I'm keeping my, my forearm up. Keep that front end off of it. A lot of times, if I get onto this horse and she gets mad, that front end wants to come on top of me, she can strike out at me or something. But when she yields that hindquarters away, I just release and say thank you. Appreciate that. That's all I was asking. Same thing as, you know, with, with, with these horses. If, if, I, if I'm saying yield, there's, I'm giving you a job to do. If you do it, we can be done just that quick. But if you want to be a butt about it, then I might put a couple whelps on your butt. We might have, it might take 15, 20 minutes to get you yield down. We both might be sweaty here in just a few minutes. If you want to be a butt about it, then I'll ask again, will you yield your hindquarters? She says yes. I say thank you. I can do it with a stick. I can do it with a whip. I, ideally, I want to get to the point where I can do it just like that. With just a little bit. Don't run me over with your front end. So she's walking off. Well, well, she's just going to, she wants to crowd me a little bit. Yeah. Now. She wants to kind of push on me. Yeah. Be a little bit dominant, and then when I push her off, she thinks she needs to move. No big deal. I just kind of clear that up. I'm not. I'm, I, I, I can, by holding that halter at about that distance. If she wants to go forwards, I can say no. I'm not asking you to go forwards. If she wants to go back, I can say no. I'm not asking you to go back. I can make those corrections by putting that feel on that halter. If the front end wants to come towards me, I can pick up here, kind of hold her shoulder up just like we would in the saddle. Pick that shoulder up, make that front end stand still. Let that hind end move away, keep the front end off of it. If I need to, if she runs into my forearm, I want it to, I want it to really, it's like an electric fence, don't touch it. You can get as close to it as you want to, don't touch it. You know? And if that shit gets a little, attitude about that but that's just her way but she's a young horse trying to see what she can get away with just like if she was in the pasture with other horses can i pick on this one can i push on this one can i if i threaten to kick this one will he move or will he kick back that's all. well that's her go-to i mean look how beat up she is trying to do that with rusty exactly she's trying to find her place yeah. in the in, in in the herd in life and this is a, a perfect time for you to let her know where her place is with us when, when it comes to people Respectful. Don't push on us. Don't step on us. Don't kick at us. Don't run us over. Mm -hmm. Don't don't do any of those things. This is where we want you to be. This is the horse we want you to be. And this is always where you're going to find your comfort. She's okay. looking for comfort. But if she realizes that she can boss us around, push us around, and be comfortable, she'll do it. She'll right. take full advantage of it. But if she realizes that hey, these are the rules, I need to stay in them, she'll do that too. Okay. So you're really, you're looking, you're putting energy on her butt to move it. On the hind quarters. So I'll shorten up from right in here. And that, just like I was telling Kevin, ask, encourage, insist. My ask is my energy. I'm saying, will you move your butt? Okay. If she doesn't, I'm going to say, I suggest you move your butt. If she still doesn't, I'm going to say, I told you, move your butt. So same thing here. I'm going to go to this side. I'm going to ask if she yields. Great. Wonderful. Thank you. Good job. That was very nice. Believes me, that's wonderful. If she does, I'm going to ask. To yield. That's perfect. That's what we're looking for. That's for her to ask. And she's pretty good with the high course, four quarters, probably a little bit more. Ask, encourage, insist. Thank you. High quarters, four quarters. With pushing horses, front end is the hardest to get because they don't want to yield. They don't want to step out of their way. They want to say, you can't push me around. I'm bigger and prettier than you are. But, you know, we want to we let her know. When I say yield, you need to yield. Just like that dominant horse in the pasture, or just like she will with her baby. She'll teach her baby all this stuff. When she pins her ears and say, get out of my way, or get out of my belly, the 
baby either listens or gets nipped or kicked or something like that. Okay. The same thing here. And you get out of my way, give me some room. If she listens, then life is good. But if she doesn't, then I'm going to escalate that, turn that up, and do something a little bit more. and pushy and rude, 